Hello, everyone. Welcome to my All for You 91 YouTube channel. Today, we are understanding the concept of ethnocentrism. So let's begin. Ethnocentrism is the belief that one's own group or culture is superior to others, with one's own group and culture as central. It was first introduced by William Graham Sumner in his book Folkways in 1906. William Graham Sumner said, Ethnocentrism is that view of things in which one's own group is the center of everything and all others are scaled and rated with reference to it. Laint and Keller defined it as the tendency to see one's own way of life, including behavior, beliefs, values, and norms, as the only right way of living. William P. Scott described it as an attitude of regarding one's own culture or group as inherently superior. Ethnocentrism can be found in various subgroups within society, such as families, schools, colleges, political parties, and castes. It refers to the tendency to believe that one's own society and culture is superior to all others. This belief includes the idea that one's own way of life is the true and right way to live, while other cultures are seen as inferior. While not all societies have the same degree of ethnocentrism, the attitude of self-centeredness is present in most individuals to some extent. In short, we say that ethnocentrism is the belief that one's own culture or group is superior to others, with one's own group and culture as central. Thank you for watching this video. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more insightful videos related to sociology.